Hello there, here's a quick little video on a scripted item that I was playing around with before. It's a little hand grenade thing, and you just throw it and it explodes. Um, it's a primed TNT, and you can... I destroyed this valley down here, so I want to throw, throw them down there, but... Uh, you can control how long it takes for them to go off by uh, setting the fuse and yep so that's it and I also gave this guy one and I just put it in his uh, hand and if I click on him he I set him to drop item and he will throw him too just kind of randomly though So I'm sure you could. Uh, I'm sure you can make that a little more directional. He could use it as a as a uh, as a projectile, probably. I don't really have that worked out right now, but I was just uh, messing around with this. Um, you could for yourself. You could probably uh, let's take a look at the script. It's not that hard. Not that complicated. Um, so you get the entity after after the tossed event that will give you the entity and I get that motion and then I summon a TNT at that position and then I boost up the motion here uh, times three the Y is boosted six times and then I despawn actually the uh, the entity the uh, dropped item and that's it. It just flies away and explodes. Uh, you could probably change the fuse right there. That's what I was looking for. The fuse um, somehow, probably if you had like something in your, you know, if you had like something in your offhand maybe, um, that could regulate the fuse. Um, you know, if you had different colored wool what is this? This is some sort of dirt or something like that. Just, uh, yeah, it's just plain dirt. Um, but if you had different colored wolves in your offhand, you could probably change the fuse inside the scripts there like that. It could probably dynamically, um, that would set a variable of some sort. It would look to the player that tossed it. I believe you could do that. Let me see. I'm, I'm opening up a whole nother <coughs> thing here. Item tossed. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, you could set the the player. Yeah. You could find the player that tossed it and uh, he could it, depending on what it had, the player had in his hand you could have another list here. If it's white wool it's 50. If it's black wool at 75 and etc etc so that's all whoa oh, I don't want to hurt that guy no okay <laughs> but uh, by changing this you can also um, by changing these to like say five whoops You can get a lot more distance there. Whoops, I'm, I'm running out. Yeah, that goes quite a ways. So, yeah, you could also change the distance. I'm not sure how you would do both of those, the fuse length and the distance, but... Uh, just fun. So, thanks for watching.